Okay, this is like the, the 10 time my teacher asked six dollars from me to pay for my textbook. I told my teacher, what do you want me to do? I don't have money. My, my mom don't, don't want to give it to me. You want me to steal or you want me to rob? I have three other siblings. I'm the eldest. My parents were vegetable wholesalers. Money was hard to come by. We were very poor because my father was an avid gambler. Every time when he made money from his business, he spent money on 4D and Toto and he lost all his money there. My parents will always fight over money. It was a very sad event because we didn't even get to see him for the last time. Okay, and he actually died on Mother's Day. My mother became the sole breadwinner, taking like three jobs. She worked the graveyard shift in the factory. My mom wasn't very generous okay, because she had this mentality of lack. She has to take care of four children. She kept money very, very tight. We weren't given money for school to see myself through education. I got many part-time jobs. I sell ice cream. I stock cakes at supermarkets and um, weekends. I will be at shopping malls, at PC show, selling laptops, work like 12 hours a day. My mother was a very, very fierce mother from young. We get beaten up over little things. We weren't taken care of because she had a lot of pressure from her husband who wasn't very involved, who was a gambler. And every time when we ask for money from her, we always get scolded. I remember there was once, I told her I need $6 to pay for my textbook. She told me no, and she just walked off like this. I went to JC and I had the first failure of my life. So I got retained. I had to apply for financial assistance and one of the admin staff told me this. Why do you keep applying for financial assistance? And I really didn't know how to reply. I went to washroom, I locked myself up and I broke down, I cried. I bought my first insurance policy when I was 20 and I saw how it actually can help me and people around me. I cut down my part-time jobs and went into financial advisory. I educated people the importance of protecting themselves and planning for the future so that no one's family will ever have to get into a situation like mine. I saw how the loss of a sole breadwinner can impact so badly to a family. Emotionally, it's really very draining. The last thing that can do is to drain us financially and insurance was able to help.